and Stephanie Panicello. Come on down. My goodness. Thank you so much for stopping by today and answering these questions for these lovely folks out here. How are you doing today? Uh, doing good. Excited to be here. Hi, everybody. Looking good over there. Sup. <laughs> Sup. <laughs> oh, I can tell I'm already going to love this. All right. <laughs> so uh, we've got a couple questions for you. Uh, so we got one for us just to sort of get the ball rolling, and we're going to go ahead and get the audience. If you guys have questions, we're going to have the yeah, microphone feel free. for you right there. You can line up. Line up right there, and we can go ahead and get those questions ready. Um, and then if it gets too long, we might not be able to get everyone, but it looks like we'll get everyone based on that. So, <laughs> all right. So our first question, come on up. Now, I'm going to ask both of you this, but I'm going to ask one at a time so that way it's a little bit easier to answer, you know. So I was always curious, and as a modder online, like actually making costumes and stuff like that for games, I was always curious, and I feel like it'll be very inspirational. If you could pick a costume for your character to wear, what would it be? Like, an, it, does, it could be literally anything, like... Uh, Race car uniform. If they were anything. to, if our character was to cosplay another character, yes, or, or anything really. Yeah, yeah. They could wear anything else. Yeah. I want to do a mashup. I want to do either Lady D in an Orin cosplay or uh -huh. Orin in a Lady D. And she cosplay. has her arm like this and everything, and the yeah. Oh my God, fantastic! I would love <laughs> yeah. to see her do Shooting Star. You know what I mean? Just uh -huh. across the whole thing. Uh -huh. Incredible. And how about you, Stephanie? Oh, geez. Uh, I'm glad I had a unique question. I was so worried it was going to be questions you've already heard before. So I'm like, is no, there a good No, I've never heard this before. Okay, so... Uh, Lady D is Godzilla. Ooh, we got just, I'm on now a roll. We're just, now we're mashing everything up. Okay. I was I was literally thinking, like, very literal. <laughs> so, it could be a regular not outfit. Not so yeah. as, like, as, like, uh, cosplaying as, like, another thing. Oh, if I can do a mashup, I guess... It would be Claire as Wolverine. Oh, what a cool idea. Lady D is Wolverine. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you're listening, modders. It's all out there. You better be writing this down. I'm just saying. So awesome. I feel like a Wolverine style, that would be kind of sick because when, she, when Claire gets angry, yeah. like it's like she goes into like a Wolverine state. That's so. You don't think true. Claire yeah. is Scarlet Witch? Oh, the red. The red? Course. We're halfway there. She just needs a longer coat. <laughs> this this just is Just add true. a bottom to the coat. This mm -hmm. is true. Or is it too on the nose? I think it's too on the nose. I'm feeling a Wolverine, but like in red. Yeah. A red wool. A road, road, red, red verine. A red verine. A red verine. She's a red field red verine. That's right. Okay. There it is. All right. And you're talking about like the, the classic one where it's like got the, oh God, help me here, where the I things that come out yeah. like in red? Or right. if we're thinking like Old Man Logan style, Ooh, like she that. already has a red leather jacket. That is, that is so, true. true. Yeah. Already prepared. That is oh, right. and speaking of, oh, we got I some see Uoboros. Uoboros, thank you so much for stopping by. We, we love them. They're actually really close to, to us. Very good friends. So as our first question, what would you like to ask our guests? Hello. I would like to Hi. ask... Um, as far as like the audition process goes, did you audition? Well, I guess this is kind of a two-in-one. Did you um, audition for any other roles in your respective games? And what would your Resident Evil dream role be? Mm, good question. <laughs> yeah, you audition for anything else? And the sun chips come out. Um, mm. I, no. yeah. No, I didn't. <laughs> yeah. So I actually auditioned for Leon and I got it. I got both and I said, you know what? Just let Nick have it. She's I... been cosplaying as Nick Apostolitas for years and nobody knows. No one knew the entire time. I have been both. Yeah, I don't. <laughs> Hold on, under the hat. <laughs> You'll oh see the zipper. Oh, <laughs> That's incredible. Awesome. Fantastic question. Thank you so much. Alrighty, coming up next, what you got to ask for our lovely guests? Um, first off, I have been growing up watching the Resident Evil games and stuff, and they're pretty cool, actually. I do have a question. What was it like voicing your characters, especially Lady D? I just think it sounds like really good, to be honest. <laughs> Sorry if I'm simping a little bit. <laughs> no, it's okay. We all, we all do. We love Lady D. Come on. <laughs> um, it was very fun. <laughs> well, she's very honest. At least it's very direct. You okay, know. well, what very about uh, Claire? 
No, I think she has more. I had more to say. <laughs> oh, okay. Don't oh. cut me off. I know her style. I know her style. She just down. eats food. More food. Yeah. I'm a slow burn. You got to give my brain time to catch up. I need 10 minutes to process the question, and then I'll have an answer. So always ask Stephanie a question first. And then by the time she's done, I'll have my answer to that very. Oh same my God! Question. You just made Lady this D so is... much more relatable, like just for everyone, uh -huh. really for me especially. Yeah. Thank my you. My brain is slow. <laughs> she's a big lady. It takes a lot of energy to move through the, you know, the body mo yeah. moving. You know? Yeah. That's um, great. Uh, yeah. So, <laughs> what was the question? <laughs> <laughs> I think it was like, what was it like voicing the characters? And Sick. Yeah, it was really fun. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just good, kidding. That is a good um, answer. It was very fun. And it was even more fun because we did performance capture for the character. So it oh. wasn't just the voice. I was able to fully embody her and do all, I got to throw that table. I got to throw <laughs> the vanity. I actually got to throw something and that was on my bucket list. So that was very, very fun. I feel like playing villains is quite fun for me because I get to channel my rage through healthy outlets. <laughs> and that's very So it's helpful. therapeutic. It's very therapeutic. It's mm. very cathartic. And I highly recommend. I highly um, recommend it. Additionally, I do have a little bit of a request. Can I hear you say Ethan Winters in her voice, if you could? Do you want to do this? It's too soon. <laughs> <laughs> he murdered my daughters. <laughs> Ethan Winters. There you go. That was good. Oh I just had to get Chip out of my throat. That's all the pause was. I'm <laughs> that, so that sorry. Was really good. It was really dramatic, but it was really just... No, it built the tension. Yeah, I loved it. Really good. I was on the edge of my seat. Cleaning out the yeah, mouth. That was really good. Thank you so the much. The pipes You're are clean welcome. now. Oh my God, and you said that you killed your daughters, but I mean, we got one oh. right here. Yeah. So she came back. She back came from back. the dead. I reanimated. Yeah. Sweet, sweet. All righty. What you got to ask so, for our lovely guests? Oops, sorry, not a question, but I did forget to tell Mother at her table yes. that one year ago, yesterday, was the first time I messaged you on Cameo. Oh, what a beautiful little anniversary if I do so. <laughs> so I the anniversary to us. Uh, has your nose been itching since yesterday? It actually has been itching. I was just itching it before I came on. Oops. Did you With practice black With magic? Yeah. <laughs> Oops. Huh. You didn't hear me yell from across the way. No. No, okay. my ears move slow too. Yeah. See? Yeah. <laughs> Sound moves very we, slowly we were through my a... ear canals. <laughs> it's all very slow mo. It's very, we were very making slow. a joke like, oh, if we're gonna say her three nope. times, would she come running? And she'll summon. Yeah. 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 Like Beetlejuice. <laughs> Fantastic. Yay. Incredible. Thank you. you so much. That just Thank reminded you. me oh, of Liam, Mr. Your boy. Kennedy. Thank Hello. you so much for stopping yeah. by, Mr. Kennedy. I haven't seen the new uh, one. Yeah. No. Who's your, <clears throat> who is your favorite male? Well, it's definitely not Leon. <laughs> what, what the Listen. <laughs> wow. Even more than Ethan, right? It's definitely like, not Leon. Oh, God. Thank you. I agree. Okay. Not Leon. Leon. It's okay. We go way back. Yes. <laughs> so. We, yeah. Tony, right? Yeah. Yeah, we go way back. Oh, okay, all right. We're yeah. allowed to say these things. Yeah. Um, yeah. We're Leon? allowed, you're not allowed. Oh, no. clearly, yeah. Got Nobody it. else. No. Yeah. Um, so, Leon is like a, a classic favorite, which I get it. We get it. You have great hair. <laughs> okay. Oh, so boring. Oh, yes, you're so broody. That's why his hair is so big. Yeah. It's full is of that what it is? is? That's why he looks it's so, so good. That's why it's so good. <laughs> Um, yeah. So what is our favorite, you said? Male protagonist. Male protagonist. Um, we're just bashing on Leon right now. It's <laughs> only because he's seems well, you to be him. so. Yeah. So. Shh, shh, shh. Oh, right. Sorry. They still don't know. Um, yeah. Keep it on the DL, you guys. Um, yeah. <laughs> it's my alter ego. Um, no. Uh, so, yeah. Favorite male protagonist. Um, that's a hard one. Obviously, I would say... Oh, are you FaceTiming yourself? No, oh, okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, no, I'm not, I'm not it. You shouldn't take that call. I not right now. Call yeah. Leon you. is here. Okay. In that case, yeah. In that case. <laughs> yeah. In that case, let's take this call. I mean, um, if it was Chris. I was going to say, I, I, want, I would say my brother, but we don't really want to say that our brother is our favorite. I'll say it for you. No. <laughs> yeah. He loves Chris. Um, but you know who else is really fabulous is like like 
Carlos is a great character. Oh, Luis is a great character. Amazing. Like some hey. amazing <laughs> characters all around. To be honest, like it's hard to really choose one. Everybody but Leon. Uh, <laughs> I'm That's kidding, incredible. I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I mean, we just didn't know Claire just had this rivalry with no, Leon, you know? No, we love Leon. Is That's that why the you thing. split off in the game? I was like, I don't want to stick oh, around this Infinite guy. Infinite Darkness? Split off. Infinite Darkness? You saw how that, that came to be, right? Yeah. yeah. So you go, you do things your way and I do things mine? Yeah. Yeah. And I'm like, hey, Leon, yeah, that outfit doesn't suit you. Oh. oh. <laughs> he will be burned for months. Oh you understand? Gosh. It will be in I'm his sorry. brain. Please don't put this on TikTok. People are going to hate me. <laughs> I'm already thinking about taking that audio and modding it into the game. No! Claire, we've got to get out of here. You just, you, we get it. You got good hair. Okay? Shut We're up, kidding. Leon. <laughs> Whatever. That's, um, no, the reason why they split is because you couldn't be in two places at once, so they had to reschedule true. the times for Leon so That's you could true. be on set for Claire and then come back and record Leon stuff. Very Superman so, Clark Kent. I love that's, how we're changing why. the canon. That's the backstory. <laughs> All right. Stop All right. telling that. Okay, I next mean, question. Thank you for waiting so patiently, Toad. Hello. Hello. Yes, Toad is here. Hi, Toad. Uh, this is a question for both of you. Um, I'm so tall for this microphone. Mm -hmm. Um... Are there any? Did you come to oh. my table yesterday? This is yeah, really in a different, in a different. Yeah, I was yeah. with Luigi. I had great. Like a yes, great. Yeah. Yes, oh, the mustache. I missed the mustache. Yeah. I know it, it was really hard to get off, and I know. it really was it really emotionally you. for me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'll try again tomorrow. Okay. Um. Every time I shave, it's the same thing. You know, exactly. very emotional. The, the regret. The regret. Mm. The regret. Mm. Woke up this morning and wasn't there. I'm still devastated. <laughs> mm. Anyway, are there any video game or like TV movie series that you're both obsessed with and recommend for Resident Evil fans? Very good question. Wow. <laughs> Maggie, there's more time. It's still coming through to you. <laughs> that we recommend that you guys don't already know. I feel like that's a hard one. I feel like you guys know your stuff. Like, I, I usually I'm coming over and people are like, did you see? And I'm like, no, nah, no idea. <laughs> I'm so behind. Um, everybody knows. I mean, I feel like the basics. Like, I guess I'm basic. Um, <laughs> I'm like, I like Hunger Games, and I like, I, I like The Last of Us. <laughs> so, you should be allowed like to say Like how these. Maggie's just nodding. Yeah. 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 I mean, obviously, we're like Lord of the Rings. Like, these oh. are all things you hey, already that know. Was mine. I know it was. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Come well, up with another, another one now. One, yeah. Um, yeah, there's just... Our flag means death. Ooh. There you I go. I don't know if these are recommendations yeah. for Resident Evil fans specifically, but they're no. just shows and stuff that I like. So Lord of the Rings, Our yeah. Flag Means Death. Yeah. Sense8, Legion. That was a very cool Ooh, show. Ooh, Legion. Oh. Legion was cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Very, very cool. I'm surprised since you guys like Lord of the Rings, you didn't pick like a costume for that for your character. Imagine just Claire in like a suit of armor or something cool like that, you know? I am so, no man. I am no man. <laughs> Actually, yeah. they probably... I'm no Leon. <laughs> 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 but I am. I'm Leon. <laughs> oh my God. Nick, thanks for stopping by. No. <laughs> What was the question? <laughs> <laughs> like what shows or video games or things like that that you either really like or that you recommend for Resident Evil fans? Heard. Yeah. 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 Hellblade's into a sacrifice. Ooh, good pick. Okay. Yeah. Like it, like it. I didn't it. actually yeah. play it, but I watched all the cutscenes and it was really <laughs> Hey, cool. that counts too. Yeah, that works. Yeah. <laughs> Especially yeah. when back in the day when a lot of games were really hard to get, like a rule of rose, it's like two hundred dollars to play. I'll watch the cutscenes. I'll, I'll watch the cutscenes. Yeah. Yeah, cutscenes so that, that, that sounds great. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you so much, Toad. Thank it's a very you, Toad. answer. All righty. Yeah. Hi. Thanks toad, for stopping by. Toad, 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 Toad. You can't start your own chant. <laughs> okay. It's hard. It's hard out, out here. here being a Toad. <laughs> All righty. Thank Bring you so back much the mustache. <laughs> toad is brave. <laughs> you know so. what that is. <laughs> what question do you have? Yeah. Hi, uh, do y'all think that Chris was texting Claire during Resident Evil 8 be like, hey sis, so I just punched a werewolf. Um, what's you up to today? Claire. How's your day going? You have to see this. I totally just punched this werewolf in the face. It's crazy. Yeah. Do you really want to know? I do. I literally was like, 
Dude, bro. Wait, are they related? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah. She's just like, she just gets this text. She, in my mind, it's probably like, literally, Chris, I think you have an anger issue. Stop punching everything. <laughs> <laughs> but it's working. I don't understand. What do you if say? It ain't broke. <laughs> well, it ain't at least broke. it's better than a boulder. <laughs> okay. Very true. Very, very true. All right. Oh, thank you. Thank, thank you. you so much. Hey, thank you so much for Hello. 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 All righty. I, I can't get yes. over how much I love your outfit so much. It's incredible. Yes. Uh, what would you recommend for someone who's just getting into voice acting? Mm, good question. I'm very distracted. I'm just looking at your hooves. I know yeah. <laughs> but they're custom really made. Oh my gosh, and you can move no, so yeah. freely. I know. They're like, oh my God. Wow. Uh, that. It completely overshadowed your question. Yeah. <laughs> Where'd you get them? I got them commissioned custom. Yeah, you did. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. Did. yeah. Yeah, it shows. They're amazing. Yeah. It, again, it's like the mustache. They really suit you. <laughs> oh, I kind okay. of feel like you should wear them regularly. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I would love to. I don't think that fits in my workplace. You know, <laughs> get a new job. Yeah. <laughs> That's wear the voice them after acting. hours. Very you can still point. wear them after hours. Hey, when you get into voiceover, you can wear those. That's the idea. Speaking yeah. of, what, what would be the best way to get into that? Stephanie? Stephanie? Sure. Okay. I got Leon? This. Okay. So. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, so, uh, yeah. So, I would say, which, again, first and foremost, acting. Right. If you haven't done acting classes, I really hate when people go, I really want to get into voice acting. And then I'm like, oh, have you taken any acting classes? And I'm like, no, why? And I'm like, what do you mean, why? I'm like, it's literally, we are acting the entire freaking time. It's acting. And then this is just a little offshoot of the acting realm of what we're doing, right? So first and foremost, acting classes, okay? If you're going to come to my table, if you haven't taken acting classes and you ask me what you should do, get enrolled in something. Mm. Um, secondly, you heard it here. If you dare approach her table. We're watching you. And you haven't taken an acting class. Yeah, that's my Leon showing. Anyways, so um, <laughs> anyways, uh, that's the first and foremost one. Uh, secondly, which is a deeper one, is which I talk to you about with certain people in, in here, um, figure out what it is that's holding you back. Get curious about what that is and delve into that and try and reframe that, mm. right? And realize if it's because I'm scared, if it's because I don't think I'm good enough, if it's because I don't even know, like... Dig into that because it's going to make a big deal for you to understand where that fear or that thing, that block is that's getting you. Because if you don't get past that one, it doesn't matter how good you get. You won't make it because you're in your own way. So get rid of that block and then go off and live your life and do your things and experience your stuff. And remember that everything is about you and what it is that you bring to a character. So whatever life experiences you have, those are valuable. Whether they're good or they're bad, they're all valuable. So keep living your life. Don't emulate anybody else. And go do it. Amazing. I love that Just answer. Do oh, it. my God. That was the most honest and direct, right? <laughs> Sorry, but continue. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt. very you. inspiring. <laughs> um, it's fun. Just the derisive tone for me. <laughs> very it's inspiring. Very demure. Very demure. Mm. Very inspiring. Very yeah. Very cutesy. Um, how did that begin? I, I have feel no like idea. It just <laughs> took over all of a sudden. Anyway, what? Voice acting. If they want to get into their career, what do they? What do you recommend? Um, I'm gonna go practical because she's already taken care of heart uh, advice. <laughs> right. Uh, great. So You Want to Be a Voice Actor is a website that you can go to by Dee Bradley Baker, who mm -hmm. does an amazing job of breaking it down step by step by step in really small, palatable steps. <laughs> so you can learn a lot by going there. Don't be afraid of the tech. I also was afraid of tech. It ain't that hard, and it ain't that deep. It don't have to be perfect. Just do it. To Stephanie's point, 
you have to find ways to extrovert your talent. If you don't, you're just going to be acting for yourself your whole life. Don't be afraid to put yourself out there. Find a way to put yourself out there. Secondly, it's a business. So don't forget that. It is craft, it is acting, but it is also business. So educate yourself on how to be an entrepreneur and a business owner. And also don't quit your day job. That's a very good because one, Because yes. you are funding the development of your own career, which requires funding if you want your materials to be good and um, competitive. So invest in your financial freedom and then use that financial freedom to help build your career in voiceover or acting or wherever you want to be because it's expensive. Headshots, reels, demos, blah, 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 blah. you're paying for it. <laughs> Make that money. All righty. I would say one last thing, and then once you do all that, know when it's time to leave your day job. And be... Yeah. Willing to take the risk and on take yourself. the full risk. Yeah. But Believe then you're prepared. In yourself and take you've the jump. set yourself up. Then. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. Sometimes you have to make space in your life for more things to enter it. So yeah. don't be afraid to make that space once you're ready. Once you're ready. But Definitely. make sure everything is Self awareness, <laughs> checking in with your heart, getting rid of the fear, checking in with your pocket. This is checking in with your pocket and your bank account. <laughs> Definitely. Let me tell you, I've actually, as an aspiring voice actor myself, I've asked that question a ton. You guys give excellent answers to that. Because you know how many people are just, uh, find an agent. Okay, bye. So no, you get on Make a real find an agent. <laughs> well, you yeah. find an class. agent by making enough money to yeah. invest in a quality exactly. demo that then you submit to the agent because that mm -hmm. is your first impression. Exactly. So make it freaking good. So I could have said another word, and I didn't. And that's called self-control. <laughs> <laughs> Which is another thing you'll need. Am <laughs> amazing <laughs> answers. Thank you so much. Thank you. All righty. Uh, up next. Next question. Stay hoofy. Stay I don't know if that's a thing, but we'll make it a thing. Yeah, Stay hoofy. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm glad you were here because they came up and I was like, oh, no, they're so tall and I'm the shortest person. How is this going to work? <laughs> they're magnificent. Are, are you Claire right now? Are you Claire right now? Yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh my goodness. I love Very it. good, Claire. I was going to say about it. This. Yeah. <laughs> Scenario B, Claire. Yeah. <laughs> All right. The only, the only valid playthrough of Resident Evil 2, of course, is Claire's. <laughs> but, um, thank you. <laughs> thank <Yes>. you. Yes. <laughs> but no. <laughs> Leon's is the best. No, it's not. Anyways, continue. <laughs> the argument within, you know? All right, what you got? Uh, so, my question is uh, there was one of the movies, I want to say it was. Um, Vendetta that had bloopers in the credits, and I was disappointed that neither of the games had bloopers or anything in the credits, so I was wondering if there were any lines uh, or, that, or scenes that you guys had trouble getting through no. without <laughs> laughing. Exactly, I was thinking, um, we're, we're amazing. No, there's yeah, no. Yeah, the constant professional. Perfect yeah. first take every time. Yeah, we, we made wonders. the director's job yeah. hard. <laughs> they were all fabulous, and they had to choose from fabulosity always. Yep. Yeah, yeah. good. <laughs> That's fair. And All that, right. That goes for both the voice acting and the motion capture. Yes, of course. Of course. <laughs> literally flawless. Flawless. S rank. That's right. S plus. Speed sorry. run. Literally. Hardcore. Hardcore. Awesome. There you go. Awesome. Well, All thank right. you. <laughs> thank you, Claire. And that is our final answer. <laughs> yes. We're not going to give you anything more, mostly because I don't remember, but I'm sure it was perfect. Yeah. Gotcha. <laughs> Awesome. <laughs> Welcome back. What more do you have for us? Sorry. I no. did promise my friend, uh, Courtney, uh, that I would uh, have you uh, uh, punish her. Punish her? <laughs> We're not coming. Good We're not coming Lord. here. She is on FaceTime if you want to oh, know. Geez, oh, jeez. No Lord. pressure. Oh, my goodness. I How dare you not come to see me, Courtney? <laughs> You'll be sliced to ribbons. <laughs> 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 oh, my God. This is all. Oh, my God. <laughs> Yeah. No, uh, I'm so sorry. sorry. Oh, no, yeah. sorry we can't. Sorry. Yeah. 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 You do from there. I mean, like, just hold it like that. Yeah. 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 Hi, Courtney. Hi, Courtney. We miss you, Courtney. Come back. You're dead to me. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Or will be oh, dead. Oh, Dugans. There's a little Dugans. Oh. Okay, you're undead to me now. Super sweet. <laughs> but just the dog. <laughs> Very cute. Thank you so much. Thank hey, you. man. Thank you. Oh, nice to see you. How you doing? I said I would be here. And you, you did. Hi. Thank you so much. What you got? I'm going to ask probably the most asked question, favorite line ever uttered by your Ooh. character. Who first? <laughs> Clean or not. <laughs> <laughs> There's children here. 
Oh. Yeah. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> what line does Claire say? Well, it's an improvised line, and it came straight from the soul. So I'll give you my clean version, which I do have little ducks at my table. They're Claire Redfield cosplayed. And the line that I write for those for our lovely clean versions is, I'll get you, you ducker! <laughs> oh, that was improv. You did that on your own for that? Yeah. Oh, that's so good. Yeah, though. yeah, isn't it? It's just it's so simple, right? I'll get you. Repeat you, ducker. <laughs> <laughs> no, but you mentioned it earlier. Claire has like a certain ferocity when she sort of gets pushed when to she her gets limit. There. Yeah, there's yeah. a Wolverine coming it's out. A Wolverine, Wolverine coming thing. Out. That's exactly. why I really do kind of feel like I relate, and I would love to play Wolverine too one day. But that's okay. She is my Wolverine. <laughs> Incredible. So at least you know that. I didn't even know that line was improv. Good job on that. Great job. Thank you. All right. You. And then uh, for you, Maggie? <laughs> uh, give her a minute. Okay. <laughs> Maggie. Too many to pick from. Is that the line? She played a lot of zombies. <laughs> Is too. that the line? <laughs> That's a real, it's true though. There's really a lot of good ones to pick from. I feel like every day I wake up and I have a different one stuck in my head and that's my new favorite of the day. Um, Oh, like a word of the day, like Pee Wee Herman? Yeah, like a, a quote Man of the day. Man thing. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't... Oh. oh, so gauche. That's a fun one. Simple, petty. You know she has style. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Elite. Very. 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 Mm -hmm. Demure, demure. I don't know this phrase. You do it. Very demure. There you go. Very mindful. I, I show you and you don't listen. Very good. It's hard for me to learn. I'm he never sorry. listens. This I is never why. Do. This is why the therapist said you need to practice listening. You need more time. It Absolutely. has to get Thank to you. you. I just Thank yeah. You. Right? A week. Yeah. yeah. You're like good year, at listening. Please. You're just not good at processing what you listened to. Yeah. And, and then remember, we start a, a, oh, he a group. <laughs> yeah. the, the trick of it is I don't want to listen, so it's a whole thing. It'll be, uh, we'll get there eventually. Wow. Okay. That'll be the group. Alrighty, <laughs> folks, just a quick heads up. We are running towards the end. Yeah, but we, we can only yeah. have one We have or a couple more, more questions. Don't worry. Yeah. But one or two. And we that have a mind. couple more questions. So yes. terrifying. Leatherface, what's so, up? Yeah. Uh, hey, so. Hey. Hi. Uh, my question is not. Uh, particularly Resident Evil related. Is that bad form since we're at the end? No, go for it. No. No, no, no. So uh, Stephanie has played a victim in the game Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Maria Flores, uh, oh. yes. Uh, Maggie, you said you'd like to play victims. If Gunn approached you and offered you a role and gave you some creative freedom, uh, what kind of character would you like to play as a member of, I suppose, my family? If you were the family, the killer. <laughs> yes. Killers versus victims. I apologize if I'm putting you on the spot. Yeah. <laughs> hold on, hold on. I'll give you time. This is Maria oh, that's a good note. Hold if, on. if Maggie had come over. <laughs> Maggie? Maggie, is that you? Oh, Maggie, I'm so sorry. It's all my fault. Wait. Wait, Maggie. What are you doing? Maggie, no! Dude, I gave you time. Come on, murderer. Well, that was an incredible impression of the air conditioning unit in the background <laughs> of that scene. I think I make that noise, and then their ears bleed, and their brain <laughs> bleeds out of their ears. Oh, that's good. I think that would be a good ability. Yeah. A siren. A siren, yeah. if I may. Yeah. Like that. Yeah, Cersei. Pretty cool. Kind of like a reverse of grandpa. Yeah. <laughs> I totally there you go. Is. There you go. We solved awesome. it. Hey. I I just and want to say, it was so incredible to see Leatherface come up, and he's so well-spoken. I'm just know. like, wow. And, and so very, very nice. Character. Thank like, you. <laughs> so <laughs> casual. You're just like, hey. And it's really improved my, uh, my, uh, uh, what's the word? Dialect? The, uh, diction. Your diction? Yeah. Diction. Yeah. Pronunciation. Ah, yeah. Pronunciation, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> we love that. Okay, I love it. Uh, it's wonderful. Ooh, here we, we love go. Self Hi. I told you your daughters that. didn't die. Look, we got two of them. They're right here. Where have you been? <laughs> I've been calling your name. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what oh. you got for us? Uh, my question, well, first of all, I'm going to take the voice acting advice and then bring it back to my intro to voice acting class on Tuesday. I hope that's okay. Yeah. Mm. Of course. Uh, spread it. My question is, if you could pick a franchise to be a part of, what would that be? <sighs> Lord of the Rings. Mm. Good answer. 100%. All day, every day. Can 
Can I just be Wolverine? <laughs> <laughs> Allow it. He took anything Marvel. from this. Yeah. <laughs> Allow it. Oh, gosh, could you imagine? They gave me Betty Ross at Marvel, but I want to be Wolverine. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Well, I mean, Marvel versus Capcom 4. It'd be cool to have Claire versus Wolverine. We'll just have this conversation come up. Oh, there was that one time she brought it up. I'm going to play, I'm going to play that team based on that panel. Okay. I think that would be sick. It actually. would be sick. I agree. Thank you. Fantastic Thank question. You. Thank you. All righty. Hi. And Hi. I feel a lot of pressure because I'm the last question. No, by all <laughs> means. No, no, no. The least amount of pressure okay. all the time. Okay. And it should be a pretty chill question. But I was wondering if your um, character had a Guilty Pleasure TV show, what would it be? Love Island. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. Uh, you just make a confession? <laughs> is it the character's Guilty Pleasure or is it me? I'm just, I'm just like imagining her watching it on a laptop in her giant bathtub like, I love this show. Uh, Fantastic. Bathtub, yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> all right, Stephanie, what you got? It's so bad that all the guilty pleasures are literally like stuff like that. Like, well, there would be probably a whole checklist. Um, <laughs> it's for my character? Yes, yeah. for your character. Claire, what would she freaking watch? Jersey Shore. Saw. <laughs> so, so poor. Gosh, Mine. no. I feel like the she. <laughs> no. <laughs> I feel like she would be watching either some sort of like. DIY kind of yeah. like mm. thing, you know. YouTube videos on like a playlist, how to make stuff, like how to, how fix how to a bike. or or like or like this family doesn't know they're getting a brand new home, you oh. know. And she's like, she's like, oh yeah, 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 you know. And she's like, she's like, oh that bathroom looks good, you know what I mean? Amazing. Like, and then like the family would be so happy because I she cares about people so much that I feel like that would be it. Like she'd be like, yeah, like looking into like how to saw this and build that from like. By hand, but then everyone's so happy at the end. So I feel like that would probably be what she's watching. She also watches those, so she just did the same thing as me and said her own guilty pleasure. <laughs> I also watch a lot of Love is Blind. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Oh, the li you can watch videos of surgeries on YouTube. I feel like Lady D would watch that. I had a friend that went through a phase. I had a lot of questions. Oh, the mole is really good too. If you guys haven't oh, seen Oh, mole is those. fun. Yeah. yeah, the mole is yeah. fun. Yeah. The mole is yeah. fun. Well, thank you. Uh, thank you for the thank question. Um, but I think there's one question you forgot to ask. Yeah, I'm so sorry. That's going to be uh, so sorry, my That's going to be the end of the question, the guest questions for now. But we do have one more question. Come to our tables and Maggie, ask them. Uh, yeah, we want to table. ask you really quick because no. it's been really itching at my brain. So, oh God. did you know that in two no. days that it's Stephanie's birthday? Oh. Did you know that? Did you know that? Yeah, I did. So, everyone, please join me in singing about, uh, happy birthday, birthday for Stephanie. Happy, happy birthday, birthday to you. you. Everybody off key. Happy, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Stephanie. Happy birthday to you. Blow the candles, Claire. And many more. <laughs> Yay! Thank you, guys. Oh, happy Aww. birthday. I was not expecting that. Yeah. <laughs> it was a surprise, you know, most thank birthday surprises. You. Were. All righty. Oh, I love it. So we just want to again say thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much for stopping by. Now, uh, Stephanie, Maggie, is there anything you want to say as our last words to our guests? Poo poo pee pee. Now keep that in your mind. Keep that in your brain. It's important. Write it down. I think Gandhi said that. <laughs> Mother Teresa, maybe someone, I don't know. I guess just thank oh, you I'm so much, you guys. Like, it, which I feel like we all feel this way. Don't, don't Stop go heartfelt heart. after okay. I went poo poo yeah. pee pee. I, <laughs> how dare you make me look like Fine. a piece of shit? Okay. <laughs> I, you know what? How about not words, but oh. interpretive dance? Oh. It is time to show you, Leon. Oh my gosh, the reveal. Oh no. Where'd she go? Oh my God. We lost her. We lost her, oh my God. Security, where'd she go? There? Oh man. That's okay, Claire's back. Claire's oh back. my gosh. <laughs> Fantastic, all right. I like the quick change, great job on that. Well, do you wanna? Uh, I know, I think that's about it, but now.